This is another way that you can create your logo to be fun and spunky. Let's create an animated logo using Canva and PhotoP. Let's jump in. After you have designed your logo and you are ready to animate it, for our practice, I'm going to use a beautiful template I found on Canva. You then need to make sure that you separate your logo icon with the slogan and the name of the company. For our practice, I'm just going to duplicate this page. And then on my first page, I'm going to delete the name of the company and the slogan, increase the icon of our logo, and then move to page two, delete the icon, and then increase the slogan and the name of the company. Once you have that separate, you're going to go to share and download the two pages as a transparent background. If you're using a kind of a free account, you can download using remove.bg or you can try out for 30 days. The link is below for you to try out the Canva Pro. It is awesome. Okay, you're gonna save as transparent. Now you're gonna jump to photo P. This is where the fun begins. You're gonna go to PSD templates and we're gonna be using a template created by Mostafa Mohammed. You're gonna scroll down until you find this animated logo and you're gonna click on logo animation and you will click on this link that says photo p jiba jaba what 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 thank you mustafa for this we appreciate it so much if you ever hear this video once it has loaded he has given us an instruction of exactly what to do so once you've read the instruction you're welcome to hide it please hide it because it's going to show on your logo if you don't hide it but you double click on the layer, you press Ctrl S or Command S, which is to save a smart object. And then you save your design as a GIF, and then you change the speed to 120%. So in order to do this, we will hide our guide. We go to background color and we double click on background color. If you want to change the color or leave it as it is, this is where you change the color. And you can even paste a hex code if you have one and that's how you change the color so let's quickly change this color and make it a nice green to follow that logo we are testing with and you're then going to replace the text that you've downloaded from canva so you're going to double click where it says check it box or you're going to double click on the check it box and it tells you this is where you're going to land your text in other words, you're going to hide the example and hide the example of the slogan. Drag the text that you've created from Canva, size it, and then you're going to Command C or Control C to change it as Smart Object, or you could go File, Save as Smart Object. Then you're going to go back to Animation PSD so that we go back to our main page. We double click where it says Replace Our Logo. We hide the logo that Mustafa has added for us there. We drag our own logo that we've created, size it, Command C or Control C or save as smart object. And our logo is done. Changed our background to make it a little bit darker. Then if you're ready, you're gonna go file, export as a GIF and you wait. And there you go. Your animated logo converted to a GIF. You're then going to increase the speed to 120% as Mustafa has guided us. Then you click on save and there's your animation logo created. If this video is adding value, please visit my website learnwithzar.com. Head over to courses and you will see that I'm busy creating a Canva Academy course where I'm building a community of uh, like-minded Canva users who want to kill it with Canva and PhotoP and any other software. And please register so that I let you know as soon as I go live. Thank you for joining me. I will see you on the next video.